Sometimes I shouldn't. Sometimes I should. Sometimes I wouldn't. Sometimes I could. Do not enter. You are divided by two sides. Put in the key and turn the key. The key turns one way. And to take out the key, you must turn it the other way. Eternity. Return the key. Living in between the balance, knowing that everything should be judged because there is a division of every single question in the whole entire world. Let's start with the difference of the first day and the last day of the week. The first day of the week is a day that we begin Sunday. Sunday is the first day, and Saturday, we rest. But when does Sunday begin? And when does Saturday end? Well, if Tuesday is not the last day, and Saturday would be the last day, then Tuesday would be the center day of the week. But then, in our own reality of seven days and two days, which we call the weekend, which one day is the beginning of the week and the other day is the end of the week, we do need them to connect. We do need Saturday to come into Sunday in order to put the J-hook, right? The J-hook hooking one quarter, and then this one comes together and hooks one quarter, and then they put the bars in, so they can never move further apart than they need to. Sunday now, but we need Tuesday to be in the middle of something, and we need Sunday to have the end of its own. And in order to have the end, we need the beginning. We must have something in between yesterday and tomorrow, which was yesterday I began, tomorrow it will end. Therefore, Tuesday, the middle of Tuesday, I need Tuesday to go back. I need Tuesday to go back over to Monday and say, Hey, Monday, okay, we forgot all about you. But I'm ending on Tuesday because Monday is the first day of the week. But I forgot. You see, Saturday, they ended it. And mother took over. The first day was Sunday. See, father finished on Saturday from upstairs. And then Sunday began. So they actually began before. Sunday is the eighth day of the week. But if we're working by weeks, wouldn't the good Lord who built everything need an in-between week from the first week he began to the middle week to the week he ended? But we're not going to get into all that. We're just going to do the simple seven days of the week. Five and two, B and E. Two is made up of one and one. So one of the twos is made up with a one. 
because it's two days and five days, right? So we have two days, which is an end day on each end, with five days in between. I'm holding it. And who's holding the five days? I am. I'm number six. I'm holding the two ends. Go ahead, do whatever you want. You're inside. The only way out, that's it. Goes that way. That means max. Nose. Going. On this angle. Southwest, southeast. Just all south something is the nose, but actually the nostrils come out and down, right? If I was a pig, I would have to lie down. A pig, right? A pig. It goes straight through. Two sausage plugged up me, it goes right down to my feet. And the pig, it goes away, right? Here, my, I run right into my, all my stink. Pig runs into, runs this way, the stink is behind him. Man stops, pig stops, pig stink goes up, man stink goes up, goes right up his nose. So we start on Sunday. First day of Sunday, last day of Saturday, and here's how I get there. All aboard. First, we take Monday. And we say Monday could be the last day. It's not, but there's no in-between. It's Sunday, so we automatically have to make Monday the in-between between Sunday and Tuesday. Tuesday, which is actually the second day of the week, could never be the end of the week from Monday because it's only the second day of the week, only known as number two in its own house. You can never do that. Tuesday needs a next day. So Tuesday gets Wednesday, and Monday gets Sunday. So Monday connects the weekend because Sunday connects Saturday that brought us here. Tuesday now gets Wednesday. Wednesday has to be in between the day of thirst, and they call that thirst day. In French, they call it jibzi, which also says to play. So now we have to connect Wednesday, okay, which is with Tuesday. Tuesday has to connect with Monday. So therefore, Tuesday is the second day of the week in between Monday and Wednesday, and Monday is in between the middle day of the week, which is Tuesday for Sunday. So now we have it all tied up Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. Thursday is now the first day of the week. Excuse me, Wednesday now happened to be the last day of the week because it's the third day and it has Tuesday as the middle day. So now we got the whole thing Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, with Monday is the beginning and Wednesday is the end. But Wednesday is special because Wednesday not only is it the end, but it's also the beginning. In which Wednesday is just like Sunday, which needs Monday and Tuesday. So now you go backwards and take instead of Monday and Tuesday, Monday is now Thursday and Tuesday is now Friday. So it's Wednesday, Tuesday, Monday. So it's now Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. It's the same thing like Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. And we need Saturday. We need Saturday to where we can end it, to where we can rebegin it again, to where Saturday ends and rebegins with Sunday. Raphael 7286 in a constellation of Pegasus. C'est dit que comme ça, en français, c'est dimanche. C'est fini le samedi, mais c'est vraiment commencé le samedi. So it started on the Saturday when God said, I rest. He's made his move. Since God is the home team, you've already made your move. He's made a move to put you in the game. God's move and then your move was made by God for you. Why do I say the word God? Because it just fits. God is all the numbers inside the moon. The only number that's missing is three. Creation of three is missing because we put one in the center of another two, but we did not complete it. Electric company. Good, bad, I don't know. I'm not coming here to bring you all the answers. I'm coming here to bring you numerological relations. The relation numerological. Like my painting in the back there? They're all upside down thinking. They're all jumping around. It's an ocean out there, my friends. And it's all in your mind. Doesn't matter what you make up. Doesn't matter what you think, as long as you're following the basics. Be courteous, be kind. Drive slow in the traffic, drive pro proper in the traffic. Excuse me, not slow in the traffic, drive proper. Do the right things, and the right thing is not made of a choice of them, 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 or them. You already know. You already have chosen what that right thing is, and you will break it because. Because they did that, I can do this, and it's all okay. Eh? Let me tell you one thing for me. Okay, I'm bipolar. The only way I got well is I shut my mouth, I moved away, and I didn't listen to the bullshit. And I didn't get into any heavy discussions with everybody that thought they already knew the answer because it didn't make a difference to me. All I want is the peace of mind. If I can't hack the forest I'm in, I'm either not going to go in again, I'll walk away, I won't be there. And if I have to be there, um, no partisans. Zimash. Long sleeves. That's what it seems to say. In fact, French seems to be ahead of everything, right? Long sleeves. I sort of ripped. Hey, it doesn't even show up in my camera, eh? Wow. You know what's really neat? I have a little space right next to me in the window. And somehow my camera picked it up and the sunlight made everything look different. There was no longer orange blinds. They were all gone. Just like in the sunlight over here. You see the way I'm touching the window? I'm touching the window. Look how long, long, long my arm is. I can sort of just block that window out. Right here. See me blocking? Is that an illusion? Does that look like an illusion? How far away is that room from here? You think that's just an illusion? I'm just going to block it out. Does it look like my arm is all the way into another room? How about Rubik's Cube? What happens to Rubik's Cube? I take Rubik's Cube. And I put Rubik's Cube here. Where, where is this? Can I see? Can I see in my camera? Brain freeze. Is that 
an illusion or what? Is that your own illusion? How much taller I got? <laughs> Not quite sure where I am right now, right? So many things to do. What is the reason for this? Well, let me see. You can crawl in and go up and come on down. Looks like JP or GP. Um, <laughs> if it rains, it won't go in, right? But just as this, it rains, it won't go in either. Why can't I just stop here? Why do I go over here? What is the reality? Anyways, it doesn't matter. Look inside of it. This is the letter G. Did you see the G? Or did you see this E on the other side? Did you see the G? The G? You see the G? You see the T? G, T? G, T, G backwards, except I didn't finish it properly over here. G, T, G. I bet you if I drew it in another color, it would probably come out a whole lot different, right? Anyways, um, there was another thing I wanted to speak about, and that's one with two, one with three, one with four, one with five. It's already 13 minutes, 13 or three. Uh, two with three, two with four, two with five. And the reason I'm not including six is because three is actually two parts of three is actually six. We don't have three. Three is made out of one individual item in between what in between the walls. Irrelevant. Okay? One, that is three, is in between the totality of the circle. That's all. It's the greatest diameter, whether it's down this way one way, whether it's down this way two ways, whether it's down this way three ways. There's only, how many ways around here? Four? Four by 90 is 360. Is this correct? So how many threes can we have? But they all have to meet on different levels. So if you had five times three, which is 15, equaling to one and a half, one fifth, one, zero, one, two, three, four, equals five. We need zero because we live inside. The rim has its own size and it's marked in darts as they go 50 and then they put 25 around the rim. The rim holding the lights, the rim holding position, whatever the rim of Earth is, it doesn't matter if it's the planet Earth. We are building. How can we build it? And we've seen them do it in Star Wars and some other movies. And you have to believe if you want it to be real, then you put it on TV and sell it to the people. Then they decide if it's real or not. But the whole thing is for me, the numbers speak for themselves. I haven't touched one piece of art in my life. Until I started doing numbers. Until I started understanding the way numbers connect to all sciences and the way, the way basics of math actually work and it's just minus and plus and the way the alphabet comes together. My name is Ronnie. R R R R R O O O R O O R R O O R N N N N N I E I E I E I O E and I equals N. 14. 5 and 9. 6 and 8 is H and F. Tall she is to be mad or a facial. Why do I say that? Because the letter H is fun. You can just do anything to it. Ash, ashes to ashes, dust to dust. That's the letter H in French. English and French. Give me three different languages. Okay, French, English, and what? German, Jewish, for the letter H, or the sound of H in their language. How do they say that letter? We need to see the letter the same way or different ways. French and English, same same design letter, different sounds. R, A-R, or E-R, or just the ear you hear. T and H, time heaven. Then we have to understand other things. I'm going to let it go with this. Two times what? Well, if you see the letter L, you must multiply it by two. Why? Because L is the twelfth letter. In basketball, there's four quarters of twelve. Four quarters equals a whole. Four times L is 48. 48 equals one half. Four is half of eight. Great! L is also half in the darts. Roman numerals, L is 50. It's half. So, since L is the 12th letter, and it's 50 in darts, which is a game, give it 24. L equals 24. Two times four, two plus four. L equals creation of two, four, six, and eight. One in the middle of two. You want to use half? That's L, 12th letter. The 21st letter is U. That's not half. That's one seventh. Seven times three is 21. Take seven times three to equal 21. But four times three to equal 12. The difference is three times three. That's I. The letter I is birth. Three times three is nine. 4 times 2 is 8, plus 1, that's 9, 4 and 1, how do we get it? 3, 1, 3, equals 7. How do we get 7 to equal 9? 7, for the 7 ghosts. Ronnie, Ronald. The 14th letter is the letter N, it's 1 quarter. Since the N is one quarter, it shows from going to here, over through the center, over to the right, one quarter N, because it has one and four in it. Since there's no Roman numerals, I won't use it there right now. One quarter, or how about four to one? That's the D letter. N, as the D letter. R is also like the D letter. In fact, the R is composed of a D and a V, both the four and four letter. D is fourth letter, V is the 22nd letter. Put a V, a right angle V plus a D on top, that looks like the R, it is the R. It also stands in cards for Jack and Queen. N is one quarter, the 14th letter, four by 14. Equals 56, equivalent to two moons, or five and six and two and one. It's when the one is in the B world. One quarter is the N. The Z is the other way. So if the Z is the other way, and the N represents one quarter, what the Z represents is 26, which is two-thirds of 39. That is the highest right, three and nine, the sky. The highest right, the red sky. A uh, red sky. Now, I don't want to get too mixed up, because I'm bringing this off the top of my head as we go. Three and nine. 3 and 9, 2 times 9 is 18. That's right. In order to get 3 and 9, you need 2 times 9, 18, and 1 plus 9 equals 27. The be gates. The one in the middle of 3, 1, 3. 3, 1, 3 is right here. In the middle of 2. 7 voids. 7 voids, 3 voids. But the 3 voids here is 5, 5, 5. The 3 voids here, actually it's 2, 5, 8. I call it 5, 5, 5. 5 goes in the center over here. Why 5, 5, 5? Because the ends meet at the center. 
since the ends all meet at the center, the center point becomes 9. The difference of 1 on this side of 6, 6 and 1 is 7, but at the same time, 9 now meets here because the only formation for this is the hourglass, which says, I'm not going to bring this to this over and above. I can drop below, I can drop below. We're going to slide it all to the center. And the energy comes in and brings it all the way down or up or whichever way, or this way, the hourglass. This to here, to here, to here, and we all meet over here. The X will mark the spot over here. And then we'll put one more line over here for this line, or we can do the letter N, but I'm not getting into this. The letter N equals to 56. It is one quarter. N also equals 1 and 4. It also equals 56, and N is also a representation of the sun. 1 times 4, 1 plus 4 is 5 and 4, the sun, and the foxhole. That is the N, and it also represents the N as it crosses over and explains it all. The foxhole is dot in the center. It's the five position between all. It's the one that I mentioned, where the 6 is all brought in, and then it is represented like this. They bring it all into the center of the hourglass. Over here, 6 and 5, F, D, E, F letters. We're only going to use, don't forget if there's four here, we're only going to use three. Right? We have to go one way only. If we're going here, we're going all the way this way. We're always going to use three. These two and one out. From in the side and one out, three. Even when you see four, it's not four. Represented by three, it's brought into the center over here. So this is like a blank five. See this? One here, one here is two. One here, one here is four. And one in the center. Here's four, one, four. On this over here. Four blacks, four whites, one in the center. The one in the center goes for everybody. One goes for nine in the center. One goes for nine, four of them are black. I'm not sure which equation I want to use. If I needed to use that equation, I would use that equation. Um, I'm not sure where I am right now. Yes, we were doing the letters. We were doing one, two, three, a quarter and a half. You, and all you have to do is a quarter and a half and a third. You have to do any more? No, because you're using the particles of what you get out of a third and a quarter and a half. A quarter and a half is four parts and two parts. Because the four part, okay, the four part comes inside over here. But the two part, all you need is the divider of this. Um, we said 56. Let me just, I'm just going to go over one little thing. Five times six, five plus six, 11 and 30, 41. One times four, one plus four. This is the number to the sun I just mentioned. One times one, one plus one, one and two equals to five and six. 77th gate, seven days a week, two and one. This will be seven and seven will equal to 49. And seven and seven is 14 equals to 63. 63 and 41, the difference is 22. V for life, 63 equals 10 and three is four, 10 for communication. Seven, seven, the seventh gate. This one will now equal 47. And after that, it's electric company and it connects right to the moon in the year we're in. One times two, one plus two is what creates 5 and 6. So the same numbers that create that will then create that. That's how they're associated together. This is the number to the sun. Since we said number 14 is 1 and 4 and 5 equals to 29, we need 4 of these. Okay, we get it only in February. But this one will equal 35 electric company. We need 4 of these because it will equal to 11. 9 and 2 is 11, 11. It will equal to parts of 11 because I'm only showing you one side. Otherwise, I'd show you 8. 5 over 4 is 1 and a quarter. Um, the same thing um, over here is uh, 4 by 29 is uh, 116. Is that what it is? 116 plus 6 is 122. 2, 1, 2. 2 times 1, 2 plus 1 is 3 and 2, which equals to 5. 2 and 2 is 4. Back to the same number. At the same time, we're going to take 4 of these. If I took 4 of these, all zeros equal 6. I need 24 added on. 24 and 116. 126, 136, 140, 146. Zion, Israel. Everything keeps connecting to the sun and the moon. The sun and the moon. The same number. Sun and the moon. Sun and the moon. Um, do you see the G, T, G in here? But watch what happens with my camera. Still see the GTG? How come it shows much more now than it did before? Raphael, 72, 86. Here's your 49. 7, seven and 7. 6 and 8. 5 and 9. 14, 14, 14. All the letter ends. Letter ends all work with 7, 8, 9. 0, 1 equals 7. 0, 2 equals 8. 0, 3 equals 9. So A, B, C. A, B, C. A, B, C all get become 7, 8, 9, become G, H, I. Okay? G, H, I. So when we bring them all to 14, which becomes 5, E, F, G. Jeff. Jeff High, how, how high? 14s are on all of them. 49, 48, 45, and this is the 10, 4, 40, equaling to the sun. I don't do the 10, and the 10 comes equaling to the sun. Communication back to the beginning, so I stop here. 59, 14, 62 is 8. This will be 5, this will be 8, this will be 9. 5, 8, 9, 5 and 8 is 13, and 9 is 22. Life, 2 times 2, 2 plus 2. Anyways, these are just numbers. I'm not going to explain them much more than that. This says one earth and one light. These numbers over here. Now, where do these numbers come from is the question. Um, wow. This one says number 34. Well, it comes from somewhere in here. I don't remember exactly where I got it, but it's all relevant to all these numbers. Um, this one says the gateway. This one says 6 and 8, 14 says space. And this one says the passage. 5, 9 is an equivalent to 17, 7, 6. It is the birth passage, and it's D-I-E-I-O. It is a re remembrance of time. It counts for 12 moons. Well, I'm having a bad pain up my arm. Um, this one over here, where did we get 6 and 8? If you go down to the crap table, this one you crap out 49. This one pays you 7 to 6. This one pays you 7 to 5. The numerological count for this is 66 or 84 uh, Pluto. The numerological count uh, for this one is 52 Earth. And for this one over here, it would be 49. 8 equals to the numerological count of 360 degrees, 49, 7 and 6, 313, which is the 2 cube. 
two sides where the one is divided by electric company. Why do I say electric company? Because when you got three around one, the one you're around is the one that's around in four corners of the five. You're interfering. 14, 14, 14, 49, 14, 63, 48, 62, 45, 59, 14, 8, 5, 9. 9 times 8, H and I. H and I, 89. This one is 5, 589. 9 times 8 is 72, times 5 is 360 degrees. 14 is 360 degrees around this cube. 3, 9, 13, 14. The up and down is 2 and 5. It's all mathematical, my friends. Whatever you're looking for will always be mathematical. After that, whatever you're still looking for is the question that you're not satisfied with because all you can get is mathematical equations and then your own deduction. That's where the schooling comes in. Once you understand all the numbers, the schooling comes in for your deduction and theories. Raphael 7286 and a constellation of Pegasus. I enjoyed this one very much.